for this problem, what they want us to do is they want us to solve for x. So uh, when solving for x, there's a couple things we need to uh, look at. Right now, I have multiple x's. I have a negative 2x and I have, an, and I have an x over there. So when we're solving for x, remember, we're trying to get something. We want to only get one x. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to combine like terms or looking and doing like kind of some kind of factoring out of common terms. Well, before we can even factor out any common terms looking at anything, what I notice is I have parentheses and a number outside multiplying. So I'm going to have to use my distributive property first to make sure I can multiply every number outside parentheses every, um, to every single term inside. So I have negative 3 times negative 2 is going to give me a positive 6x. Negative 3 times 2 is going to give me a negative 60. 8 times 2 is going to give me 8x. 8 times uh, 12 is going to give me 96. And now what I can do is I can actually combine like terms. I see that I can combine these because they both have my x's and I can combine my numbers. Remember, you can't add um, a constant with a multiplied by a variable to just a regular uh, ver constant. So this, let's see, we get 6x plus 8x is going to leave me 14x. And uh, let's see, we have negative 60 plus 96 is going to give me 36 equals 92. Now, at this stage, I'm at a two-step equation. So what I'm going to have to do is subtract on both sides by 36. And this will get a 14. That is the answer I was looking at. Hmm, that's not what I thought it would be. Equals 14x, I'm sorry. Equals 56. Yes. Now I'm going to have to divide by 14. And let's see, 56 goes into 14. Well, it's going to go in there 10 times. That will be 11. And... Let's see, 11 with uh, 2 over 14, which would be 1 7th. So I don't know if the decimal approximation will be, but it would be 11, 11 and 1 7th would be your decimal approximation, or your fraction mixed number, but we'll have to go and look at uh, decimal approximation for that. And that's final answer. Looks like it goes in there four times. I don't even know where 11's coming from. It's kind of like the end of the day. <laughs>